mind games going into this? I don't need to play mind games. That's not a mind game, not shaking hands. I don't need mind games. I'm 33. I've boxed, as you just said, I've boxed Canal Alvarez. I've boxed Jaime Munguia. I don't need to play mind games with Anthony Farley. He's from my own city. Yeah. You know, if you want to play mind games, I'd fucking phone him and go and meet him or whatnot. But, you know, I don't need mind games. I, I never said something there that was a lie or to make him bite. The only thing I've done was not shake his hands because I don't want to. I'm not shaking his hands if we're friendly, walking away and being in the gym, working hard, hating Anthony Fowler. Yeah. So I'm just not, it was not, it was, there was no malice behind it. I'm just not being false. How much does it mean to you, like, the breaking rights for Liverpool? That must uh, play a big factor in this fight. Of course, that's what's got me bang up for this fight. This is a da- local derby in Liverpool. I've seen my brothers in local derbies and it's a, it's a derby that I'm bang up for. And uh, with Anthony Fowler, he's, he's got one defeat against Scott Fitzgerald. That's his only significant test today. Uh, what was your thoughts on that fight? And do you think he's improved much since then with Sam McGuigan? Uh, yeah, I think he's improved. The jab's got a little bit better, sharper, whatnot. But I think, uh, again, I just think it, once the fight goes on, he always reverts back to what he, what, what he does and what he knows. So yeah. I think he runs out of ideas and starts to come apart after four rounds. And I remember when you fought Liam Williams twice, there was a bit of needle there and, you know, you got that... Yeah, that was needle, you know, I don't think there was much needle there, nah. you know, but the, 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 the handshake was just, I'm not, I'm not lording a false sense of friendship when it does not at the moment. No, of course not. And mm-hmm. after this fight, like, where do you want to go after this? I want to push back onto where I was going anyway, you know, I want to push back onto challenge for the world title. Do you want Fargus? Yeah, that would lead to Jesse Barks, right, the fight I'd love, but first and foremost, I'm... I'm Anthony Fowler's on my mind. Yeah, of course. And like, what, what's the crap with Cullum then? Is he moving up to light yeah, heavyweight? He's in the States at the moment saying he's going to move to light heavyweight. And, you know, I'm looking forward to seeing him back. Absolutely. Yeah. Is, is there any other news on your side, like going into camp? No, obviously I'm, I'm, I'm in camp now. And again, you'd be a fool if you think I'm overlooking Anthony Fowler. No, of course not. Well, thanks for your time, Liam. Nice one, mate. Thank Come you. Tommy. Good luck. Have a good camp, mate. Nice. Nice. Check it out. Yeah, yeah.